Hello everyone. Welcome to our video on diclofenac, a widely used medication. Today, we'll explore its uses, class, side effects, and mechanism of action. Firstly, what is diclofenac? Diclofenac is a non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drug commonly known as an NSAID. It's classified as an NSAID because it belongs to a class of medications that work by blocking certain substances in the body that cause inflammation. Now, let's move on to its class. As a non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drug, diclofenac is in a class of medications that work by blocking certain substances in the body that cause inflammation. Its primary uses include conditions involving pain and inflammation, such as arthritis, menstrual cramps, and acute injuries. So, can diclofenac be used for long-term conditions like arthritis, and why is it effective in these cases? Yes, diclofenac can be used for long-term conditions like arthritis. Its effectiveness lies in its ability to reduce inflammation, providing sustained relief over time. Now let's see mechanism of action. How does diclofenac work within our body? What is its mechanism of action that helps to reduce pain and inflammation? Diclofenac works by inhibiting an enzyme called cyclooxygenase. This enzyme plays a crucial role in producing prostaglandins, substances that contribute to pain and inflammation. By inhibiting cyclooxygenase, diclofenac helps reduce the production of prostaglandins, ultimately relieving pain and inflammation. Why is inhibiting cyclooxygenase important for reducing pain and how does it differ from other pain relief medications? Inhibiting cyclooxygenase is essential because it decreases the production of prostaglandins, which are responsible for pain and inflammation. This sets diclofenac apart from other pain relief medications by directly targeting the root cause. Now, let's address an essential aspect. What are the potential side effects of diclofenac? Understanding potential side effects is crucial for patients to monitor their health. Common side effects may include gastrointestinal issues, such as stomach upset or ulcers. So then how can individuals minimize the risk of gastrointestinal issues when taking diclofenac? Taking diclofenac with food or milk can help minimize gastrointestinal issues. Thank you for watching. If like this video, like and subscribe.